U.S. tax is releasing the, the VCI 300. This is a MIDI control, an all-in-one MIDI controller with an integrated sound card, microphone input, headphone output, everything you need to be a mobile guy or on the road. You want to be able to use Serato's new program. The Itch is the program that comes with the VCI 300, and again, it's a dedicated controller for this program. The great thing about this program, it's a very easy to use program. Right out of the box, once it's installed, it's ready to go. No serial numbers, no registration. You load it, when the VCI is connected to it, it recognizes it, and it's good to go. As you can see from the screen, it shows you the tracks you have to choose from, as well as your left player, your right player, and your two tracks. The top track is my left, the bottom track is my right side. You have really nice audio controls on the VCI 300. This is top quality all the way around. They cut no corners on this. Really nice pitch controllers, input faders, cross faders. With all these, you have controls as well. A cross fader, you have a cross fader curve control, as well as input fader curve control. These are light faders. So for the scratch guys, this is perfect for punching stuff in and out really quick. And same thing with the cross fader. Very light but heavy duty crossfader. The platters are dual sensitive. You have pitch bend on the outside, but scratch on the inside. If you're, if you're not a scratch guy, you can turn the scratch off, and then all you have is pitch when it's playing. This will just be pitch control. Besides the platter and the scratching controls, you have three cue points per side. So I have a cue in and a cue out. Both the, the entrance and the exit are completely adjustable. So if you miss your cue, if you came out too late, you can, you can trim it, and I'll show you that in a second. You have trim control per channel, as well as a three-band EQ. We have auto loop, which will automatically loop the song for you for, uh, for any sort of duration you want. You can do it for a whole measure, two measures, an eighth of a measure, any way you want to do it. The center section here is where you select your tracks. You have your master outputs here, you have your master one, your headphones select between the cue and the master output so you can mix in your headphones, the headphone volume control, and then the same exact thing for the right side. It's a mirror, so whatever's on the left you have on the right. Now, I'll go into using the actual controller. This is probably one of the best programs for this controller you can get, um, just due to the performance. It's very responsive. This is pitch control, so I slow it down or speed it up. Or I can go into scratch. And it goes right into it. There's no latency. I can grab it, release, which is right on. So the VCI 300 offers three sets of cues and loops per side. And I'll demo the loops right now. To begin the loop, you hit Q1 in, and then out. That's the input. That's the output. It highlights green. And you can, you can adjust the, uh, the, in, the, the in and the out. So if I, if I screwed up the output, I hold the out. While it's looping, I could trim. perfect now it's my out. The in, the in was, there's the end side. That's out. I can do that three times for three different sets of cues and loops. The VCI 300 has an integrated sound card that offers a set of RCA outputs as well as a balanced TRS set of outputs. It also has a through, so I can connect a CD player or a turntable or something through this section. Uh, God forbid you're in the middle of a gig and your computer crashes, you just hit play on the CD player, it goes through the whole unit right out and there will be no down audio. There's no downtime. So while the computer's rebooting, you still have music playing and it's pretty seamless. So it's a pretty smart idea on this piece. USB powered, 
There is an optional 9 volt power supply, but it's only needed if you're using a USB hub. Most computers, actually all computers, have more than enough power to run the VCI 300 and the sound card.